this your girl Anita Gill. Like, share, and subscribe. And before we get started, I want to tell y'all young men something. I am not an old lady. These glasses are old. I'm not an old lady, but uh, yes, I'm a grandmother. I'm glad to be a grandmother and a mother too. Beautiful kids. But look, I'm drinking coffee. Today, I want to come on here and motivate and inspire some of my young ladies and, and young men, you know, in the right direction of a relationship. Now, if you're not interested in keeping your relationship or how to treat a woman or a woman treat a man, then you're in the wrong place. Okay? So we don't need to hear from you in the uh, comment section. And y'all, I need subscribers. Please like, share, and subscribe. I have a whole brand new page that I'm working on. I want to keep it on you all. How can I motivate and inspire you all to lead your life in a in a, in, in a direct prospect space so you can be happy and healthy? Okay. Did you know the way you eat? means a lot to your system. Do, do you know sometimes you have to change the way you eat? You know, sometimes eat your little veggie, little veggies. Eat you a fruit. Now, I ain't said stop eating the food that you eat, did I? No, I didn't. I said sometimes the way we, our new nutrients is very important to us. That's another story. But today I want to talk about what does a woman need to fall in love, guys? Dude, this is the <laughs> what a woman needs to fall in love, guys. First of all, you have a mother, or either a grandmother, that raised you and they raised you how to be a young man. And a respect for young men, regardless of being gay or not, that don't, that's not. But you still, still some nice young men in the game. But what we're talking about is men's period, young men's period, and young ladies, young ladies, especially. I have to talk to you all because you you're going in the wrong direction in finding love. Okay, you're tired of listening to your parents, which trying to lead you in, in the right direction, not trying to tell you what to do. They just want you to be positive out there because life has really changed. Not life, but the people who in life. Okay? So let's get into this. What are some, we're going to talk about what are some trend Oh, look at my phone. Okay, what are some trend to fall in love? One thing that a want, what a want, a young lady is looking for, and a young man. I'm gonna talk about ladies, guys. Ladies are looking for someone who appreciate them, who appreciate them the way you met them. That's how they they are. Y'all didn't get me. I'm trying to talk, turn my voice into it. I'm in my coaching voice. I need to come down. Let me get right here. They, the ladies, women are looking for guys that who appreciate them. They don't realize that their parents appreciate them. But, and their grandparents appreciate them. Whoever raised them appreciate them. They think they hard on them, but then they go, go out and they find a young man and a, a, a young lady and you, you, you look. The girl is looking for someone who appreciate her, okay, for who she is. A young lady wants to feel love, guys. They they want to feel special. Oh, don't you know they'll feel special if you bring one rose to them? Now, it's type of girls that you choose don't like this. Me. You come in here and give me one beautiful smell, good smelling rose. That'll, that'll show me that I appreciate. Did you just show me you appreciate me? And you love me. I don't care if you're one rose. The little thing that you do shows me that you appreciate me. 
a woman want to give priority to show you how she appreciates you. They want to give it a priority. Give them, give them that priority to take control sometime. Now, if you got to spend your time raising a young woman to become a woman, you're wasting your time. You're training her to be with another man. Now, for a woman to fall in love, she needs to know that the man she will appreciate that, that that a man that she chooses is going to appreciate her the way she is. Okay, now you got say like a, for example, you got this woman. You met this girl now. You just met this beautiful looking girl. Y'all always going by the looks, and guys, we y'all got to get out of it. Stop. Going by looks, looks in part, you know, uh, uh, the attraction is okay, okay, but sometimes you can take the beautiful look with all that makeup on, sexy and everything, and come out that makeup, they want they're another person. So, who are you looking for? Who are you looking for? Because I hear a lot of guys saying, Oh, this girl don't appreciate me, she don't get it. What did you do to her? For her to not to appreciate you. Now. I noticed that. A lot of girls. Really appreciate a guy. To hold the door open for them. They feel special. They going in the store. And girls. Ladies. Young ladies. I don't care how you feel about yourself. If you see a young guy open up a door for you, tell him thank you. Don't do like that. No, he did something special for you that your own man don't do for you. A lot of women feel special and appreciative when they are at the restaurant and you pull a chair out for them. But the other couple's looking because you, your man did it, but then they whispering, yo, they old man here and said, you ain't even pulled my chair out. That's a special man. Open the car door for them. A lot of women used to know me. I'm used to men open the car door for me. Now, when I get mad, I'm all wanting to open the door. <laughs> But don't do that. A lot of women, a lot of women are looking for you to pay attention to them. Those are some of the things that y'all need to consider. Now, I'm gonna tell you another thing. We're gonna talk about. <laughs> I did like it when I, I I just need some uh Y'all ladies in him. A woman can tell within 35 seconds if you're the right man for her. If you and her together, she can tell in 45, 35 to 45 seconds that you are the person that she looking for. And then, you know, guys, what you think, girl, young lady. <clears throat> <clears throat> the way that guy communicates to you is the way he is. Y'all didn't hear me. You're not paying attention. You're not paying attention. The way that guy communicates to you is the way he is. You know he that way. You know she's that way. But girls, you see what kind of guy he is. But you see what you want, but you ain't spend time to see is that the person going to appreciate you. Now, 
Also, ladies, before before you fall in love is is. You know what you want. You know, a woman knows what she want. A, a woman knows what she wants. She don't know what she needs. But she knows what she want. But what you want might not be good for you. You see, they don't have time. For, they already a busy person. This man already a busy person. He a hustler. He do his thing. And he busy. You already know that. But then you want the man to give you attention. That ain't the man for you. Now you got this nice guy, broke. When I say broke, I think he want to do a lay around the house and eat your food up, your cheering food up. You don't need him. You don't need another body that you has to take care of. That's not appreciation, girls. Getting a guy that laying around the house with you. And a lot of women, girls, your ladies, young ladies, You don't need a man. That's not love. A man laying, both y'all laying in the bed every day, smoking every day, having sex, every smoking, laying in the bed, eating all day. Why the chick ain't work nowhere, but you hustling. It's okay if you hustle, but y'all doing the same thing every day. If that's what you want, that's not a, that's not a, uh, that's not your man. That's your friend. Now these days, I want to I wanna talk about something that women got to come out of doing. Because what you're doing is making hard for another woman like me. The things that young women tolerates now is the, is the things that the older men, that's why the older men are taking them from younger guys. Because this young girl don't care what this older man do. Just as long as he take care of her. And that's not good. But Kyle, he can go out there and bring anything back to you. That can harm your body. So what an older man will do. Let me go find a young girl. And they twins. Not a, a late, a real woman my age. And what they do is. They... Get them. They make them fall in love with them. They show them that they appreciate them. I love you for life. All that good thing in their ear. And she likes that. As long as he tells me that, as long as he's showing me this, I ain't going nowhere. This is what the young lady's thinking about. They're not even thinking about nothing else. A young woman don't even care if he bring another woman in the house. He don't, she want him to go talk to an older lady. She do. They don't care anymore. That's why it's so hard for good women to go out there and find a good man. Because y'all may need no good men do what they want to do. And that's not good. It shouldn't be no two-way street in a relationship. Because your health is important. And when it becomes too late, to make that change, you gone. Life supposed to mean something to everyone. Not, I gotta die with some. No. I'm not gonna die this way. Some people don't, some young people haven't lived their past. My children, they, they young. And they ain't paid, y'all, y'all, some kids ain't past my age yet. They ain't got up there to meet my age. Now, you can sit there all day and say, what did that old lady talk about? I ain't old. I'm not old. My glass is going to make me be old, but I'm smart when it comes down to a man. Because I, you have to, what women has to do is take, take their body and make their body be special to them. Your body is not supposed to be passed around. Young ladies, your body is not supposed to be passed around. And just because you are having a bad relationship with your mom, 
doesn't mean that you super go supposed to go date her man that she had back in the day who she appreciated because that's what she appreciated then you come he comes to you because you want help you got a child and you want help so you looking for someone who appreciates you because you didn't get that love from your mama that's the wrong case you don't do that that's not going to help you. That's going to harm you. Trust me. Because what's what going to happen right there down the road, young lady, is what he did to mom, he's going to do the same thing to you. And that's not appreciate. That's not saying that he appreciates you. Or you appreciate somebody like that. No, you don't. Because let me tell you something. Go to school. Get your education. Get you a job. Think Settle down, get your man and your baby place together, and think about who you looking for. And it's not that women just want men for money. You need money to be in a relationship. Yes, you do. Bills got to be paid. I can take you out to eat sometime, but you need to be able to take me out to eat. I don't buy me in cigarettes. That appreciate that show me that you really appreciate me. You ain't me to buy not since I've been with you to buy you not one pack of cigarettes. Now, <laughs> Woo. now on the communication level, this is this is this is where we messing up at, y'all. If you meet someone and they sit down and tell you the truth about them, you need to have all ears open because they told you. Now wait a year come and then you go to tripping because you don't got hooked. A woman don't need nobody for no super superficial thing. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm talking about. They don't need nobody for the, no superficial thing. That's why you see a lot of women with women and men with men, men with women and stuff like that. Because that 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 uh most guys are just in that this era the superficial aspect on her. When they look at her, they like, wow, I'm gonna get that. And when they get it, they tired of it. But we're going to keep it, we're going to keep it on point. It's about a, a woman, want a man to know that it's about accepting her and letting her know she's perfect just the way she is. Now, what I'm seeing in life, I don't see that with my, my children because they strict like me. They young. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to tell you what I see now with young girls. They having babies with these guys who got money. Thinking that that's what's going to make him stay with her. It don't work like that. It don't work like that. A man just don't stay with no woman because she has a baby. Think before, y'all, we got to stop making babies. Young lady, think before you have a baby. Love gonna make you feel like you want a baby. Stop focusing on children right now, baby. You, you women, young women, we got to stand up and say, let me get myself together. Let's get ourselves together first. What you mean by get ourselves together? Need a foundation. Well, how are we gonna pay the bill? I need to get a job now. And don't let nobody tell you not to work. I can give you a hundred dollars. No, let me go get my own. Let me go get my money so I can be able to do something for you too. She trying to show you that she wants to do something for you to show you that she appreciates you also. Money, finance is, is, is important in a relationship. You take a, you take a young lady who got everything. She got her own place, own car, own job. Now she's looking for someone to appreciate her. Now when a woman got all of the above like me, 
we don't want to take care of nobody. They, they don't went through it with guys not having a car and trying to talk to them. That's a trick because you're not going to be driving my car. So, girls, what y'all need to look into before a guy starts talking about he loves you, can he come live with you? First of all, you don't need to come live with you. Give him time enough to you get your, allow yourself time to get to know him. You'll know in 45, 50 minutes whether or not you want him. So you need somebody who has their own spot. I don't care if that is stamp check. It's nothing wrong with I know people saying that uh, the probably a lot of boys still stay with their mama. It's, if, if she got three, if your mama got three empty bedrooms, baby, and let me tell you something. Y'all can split y'all. If he working and she working, they can split them deals together. Because when you go out there in the street, and go get your apartment. Don't you know apartment now like a thousand dollars? Everybody ain't no session eight. But the ones who have to pay rent, that that rent higher than what I pay on my mortgage. Yeah, you yeah rent that room for me. So you won't get out there because the money that you making don't make you less of a man. The money that you making. All your money, your every money, every bill that you every money that you make on go on your bills. So it's nothing wrong with y'all guys living with your mama, but it is a problem with you bringing somebody in to her house. No, you take that person somewhere else. So girls, the first thing you want to do, get your own spot because you said you were grown. Guys, go for you too. Get your own spot. But if you ain't in a relationship, you might as well stay where you are if you happy. You got it made. Because when they put your behind out, you can't come back here. <laughs> right? So, understand how to keep a girl. This one young man on the show the other day said, I, I, don't, she, I want this girl bad, but she don't want me because you cheated on her. Now you ready to straighten up. She haven't forgot what you did to her. A woman don't forget what you did to her. Now, you didn't cheat, but she cheated. That's the kind of woman that you got. You ain't know what kind of woman you had. That's why you should have learned that woman. That's why you should have learned that man. But money, don't let nobody tell y'all that after four to five seconds that you don't know what kind of person you sitting there talking to. Y'all, I don't been through that. One guy just said, said the wrong thing. And by, I couldn't tell that guy what to do. I was like, well, I, I, I got to go home. My daughter said, <laughs> me. I got to go, but I'll be, I'm going to call you. I'm going to call you. No, I'm going to call you. I delete that number soon I got in the car. I said, not me. Not me. And girls, now these days, you better do a background check. You better do your background check. You better do it. You'll know whether or not he on prescription dr drugs. You'll know whether or not she on prescription drugs. So we want to, we want to, we want to stay where women know when she is appreciated by a man. She really know. She needs to know know this about you. Now you may be with somebody. Who wants to, you just met and you want to show her that you appreciate her, but she won't give you a chance because the trust issue. You have to have, anytime you hear a man say you have, you have trust issues, you tell him, they ain't right I do. Because every time you turn around. You want to go with your buddies. But baby, that don't mean I'm cheating. Which the truth. But he was doing that, young lady, in the communication from the four to five seconds when y'all was together. 
But you didn't care. You didn't try and get you a place to stay. Y'all got to stop that. Stop trying to get you a place to live. Stop trying to get, I don't mean, you, okay, you don't been with this guy. You don't been with that hustler. For a long time, he took care of you. He was good. Y'all was looking out for each other and everything. Then he don't pass away. Now you trying to go in there and trying to find another hustle. That hustle ain't like that hustle that you have. So you need to be careful. Focus on you. Get your life together. Get your place together. Get your mind together to get somebody who's going to appreciate you because that ain't the same hustle that you met before. That ain't the same businessman and the church man that you met at the church and at the business. When you leave him, that ain't the same guy. Now you got to do another back, back. You know, you got to do another background to check. Now if you in a relationship... Learn and appreciate who you have, y'all. Ain't nothing out here in the streets. You can't get your woman fat by telling her you want four and five children from her. And then you disappear. Because the children at home, then you run away from your, run away from your, your people, your children that you helped birth, born, birth. So you decide, oh, man, I ain't about to stay home with each other. These your children. Now you're going to go throw them out on the teachers. That's not the teacher's job to raise your child. So, try to find out what you need to do, who, who you really want to fall in love with. Do you really want to fall in love with? Okay, it might not be a man. It may not be a man. You may be done been through so much with a man. You might want to try, you know, other other people. That's up to you. Now, another thing, guys, y'all gotta remember now. You wanna, um, you gotta remember that women, some women have shy behavior because they don't know you. They trying to get to know you, and then you don't introduce them to your mama already. That girl scared. He's all, oh, baby, don't be scared. It's just my mama. Hell, I might want to meet your mama right now. She gonna be uh, that lady right now. It's an unusually shy person right now. She don't even know you that good, and you better inter don't introduce nobody to your mama. Not too soon. Don't introduce nobody to your auntie, young lady. So soon and fast. Stop falling in love so fast. Stop falling in love so fast. Now. A woman knows. When she's in love with a person. Now, ladies, something we got to pay attention about. That's why you have to communicate. You got to see what he want. Listen, he telling you what he want. You know what the first thing I do now? Hey, you got to, you got to do your background check. They got so much social media out there. You can put his name up. You see him on a, a social media with a with a woman, and he tell me he in love and stuff. And you just found out he was married. So. Women, this ain't got nothing to do with um, what you call it, low self-esteem or nothing. Don't let nobody tell you that. Do your own personal investigation on that guy. Social media, they got Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, YouTube, Snapchat, all these kind of Twitters. Go on now, and you're gonna be shocked. Damn, he told me, what? Ooh -wee. Another thing, guys, you got to remember, they are different. All women are not the same. It irritates me to hear some black men talk about black women. Because they are strong women, they supposed to be. Now the men don't got trapped in their position, 
And then they want to doll up the women out there. That's just because they had went through something with this young girl. Now they made with all the women in the world. Now all the women in the world are bad women. Now you met that bougie woman. There are some women that bougie. You got women that outgoing. You got women that athletic. You have to know this. You met her in the dance club. Don't change her. Try to change her from being in the dancer. You trying to change this down so I take care of you, baby. And then she at home with somebody else while you at work. You still got to come. If a man, if you have to meet, if a, a girl have to. When a woman, when a girl, y'all got to sit down and you know what, if a person not serious with you, if that's not what you want, that's not what you're looking for, because they'll tell you anything on the phone to get in this superficial stage on you. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Super aspect of you. They, 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 they know, they... They, they want to be on, they'll tell you anything on the phone to get what they want. See, I tried what you said and it didn't work because you're going too fast. Slow down. You you young. We all make mistakes in our 20 from 18 on up, y'all. From 18 on up to 29. Now, 30s, you're supposed to be ready to be settled down. But I hope that these sons will help some some of these excuse me, relationship. Ladies, remember you have the weapon of controlling. <laughs> the aspect of any human being. You have something that can control them. So stay pretty. Pay attention. Do your own background check. And you got the ones that on a negative behavior. If you're looking for a negative man, he right up your alley. You like to raise sand, that's the man you need, man. But if you if you looking for a headache, you're gonna get a headache. Do at the first four to five minutes. For the first four to five seconds, you should know. Is this what you want? And stop playing around with them and let them go. This your girl, Lamita Gill. I want y'all to like, share, and subscribe. And I want you to leave in the comments what you think. And again, and I say this and for the last time, I'm not no old lady. I'm not but 38 years old. I'm out. <laughs>